Amazon is getting into the space race, revealing plans to launch global broadband satellite internet. Hi, I'm Chris with the Mobile Internet Resource Center, here to show you some satellite internet news that has uh, just popped to the surface. There's uh, some regulatory filings from Amazon revealing uh, the existence of a Project Kuiper, which is Amazon's plan to launch 3,236 satellites to bring global mobile broadband to, well, to the world, uh, most of the world anyway. Uh, there's very, very few details of this other than this is basically the first set of filings that Amazon has to make to try and get the, the legal licenses to enter the satellite broadband internet world. Um, but it is definitely interesting because Amazon has the, the, the resources to follow through and uh, Amazon founder, um, billionaire Jeff Bezos has been personally investing a billion dollars a year in his space startup, Blue Origin. So what do we know about Project Kuiper? This is another low Earth orbit satellite um, constellation similar in scope to what SpaceX's Starlink, an, another billionaire, and um, OneWeb, which is backed by billionaire Richard Branson, um, is doing where you have thousands of satellites um, all in synchronized, synchronized orbit to provide global coverage from a low altitude, a relatively low altitude compared to geosynchronous satellites, which are 23,000 miles away over the equator. The advantage of low altitude satellites like this is that you don't have any latency issues. You don't have that half second delay as the speed of light impacts the your click going to a satellite over the equator and back to Earth. It can actually potentially have cellular and fiber optic caliber latencies and speed. But the catch of low Earth orbit satellites is rather than being in a fixed spot in the sky, they are constantly moving and that's why it takes potentially thousands of them to make sure that there's always at least one overhead. And, well, it makes antennas very complicated because the satellites aren't fixed. So you have to have antennas that can lock in without needing to be aimed. So this is a hugely ambitious project. Um, SpaceX is joining, uh, Amazon is joining a race that uh, SpaceX has already got two trial satellites up on. Um, um, OneWeb has actually launched their first six of their satellites towards building their big uh, massive constellation. And well now Amazon is potentially getting ready to start this race as well. It will be years until the final details are revealed and until you know, until the system actually gets off the ground. But competition is heating up. Uh, competition is usually good for everyone. And we will be seeing a lot more interesting options coming as far as satellite internet in the years ahead. These videos are brought to you by our premium members, our mobile internet aficionados. They make it possible for us to track this news and create these videos. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe to our channel, or better yet, consider becoming a member yourself.